All right, I feel like I have to. <laughs> there will be a lot of relaxed people near Lincoln Center tonight. Yeah, that says a lot, right <laughs> in the heart of the city. Hugh Jackman is hosting a mass meditation event, and you can watch it online for free. Joining us right now to talk about it is one of the special guests at that event, uh, neuroscientist Dr. Tony Nader. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. So this isn't just a meditation event, I should point out. It's a trans transcendent transcendental meditation. What does that mean? To transcend is to go beyond, and so we want to go beyond the surface level of the busy mind that is always buzzing around and dive into oneself by calming down, and that happens naturally and very easily, so it's a very easy process that allows us to be in touch with our true self and really use our full potential rather than reacting to things in an automatic reflex way. Oh, tell us how this will happen at tonight's event. Tonight is to celebrate the process of what we're going to be launching for New York and for America, where we'll inspire people to be healthy, happy to overcome their problems, and be able to manage their life by using exactly that, their full potential from within that we have in ourselves, our ability to heal ourselves, our ability to overcome problems, and be more creative and more resilient. Something that we need, as Oprah Daily wrote about today, during the election time that we're in. How did Hugh Jackman get involved? He has been meditating for a long time. He okay. has seen the effects and the positive results in his own life, okay. in his creativity, in his work. And he wants to share this with everyone so that everyone can benefit from this very simple, very easy process. Huh. I know this, are, uh, we need it, we're a busy city. So what advice would you have for someone who maybe isn't able to calm their mind and really relax? Yeah. What is one of the first steps they should take? Um, they should uh, learn transcendental meditation. <laughs> <laughs> that, well, that's to the point. That's a very good step because it's very easy. You learn it in yeah. th uh, three steps, actually three days, yeah. and then you do it on your own. Uh -huh. But for like a daily living to start okay. with, uh, remember to take a step back. Yeah. When you are in a situation, usually, if we are challenged, there is a part of our brain that comes in, and that is a fight or flight response. We're ready to kind of pounce in, and maybe there are better solutions. Yeah. So even if you take a step back, just to a few seconds, yeah. and then see the situation from a bigger perspective. And I assume that it's a key part of your new book, um, Consciousness, is all there is. Yes. Yes, the book really highlights the importance of awareness, of consciousness, rather than being just a reflex, aut reflex automatic, like a robot kind of behaving person. Broaden your consciousness, broaden your awareness, see new possibilities, mm -hmm. and that allows you to handle your life and manage your creativity in, yeah, in every way. Love okay, it. so we know. So a lot of it starts with the breath. Yes. And we go from there. And you have a calming effect about you. <laughs> yes, Your exactly. And the accent. And just, yeah. <laughs> Dr. Nader, thank you for joining us here today. Yeah, if we thank had, you for if we had me. phone books, we'd have you read it because <laughs> it's very calming. Or read the stories in <laughs> yeah. the news and make us all calmer. For more information on how you can stream tonight's meditation event, you can visit meditateamerica.org.